what is going on everybody welcome back to the channel so in today's video i will be going over the fog rift catacombs this is going to be pretty close by to the castle front side of grace which i would probably say is going to be pretty much the only way and the fastest way to get there now a lot of players might go into this area and go um where are we at i also want to mention guys i am pretty early on in the dlc at the moment but i was actually exploring a bit and did end up stumbling upon the catacombs so i was like you know what let's do it so to find this though all you will simply have to do is basically go through the valley here there is going to be a lot of enemies do be careful with that you're also going to see coffins everywhere but follow that route you will then see the lights to the catacombs Okay, so the first thing I have to mention here, though, is I did go through the catacomb a bit to explore it. And I have to say right now, guys, they absolutely killed these. These are so dang fun. There are so many places to go to and actually explore. And on top of that, though, the enemies in this cave are also going to do a crazy amount of damage. And the funniest part, though, they legit have trap floors that come down and smash you. So before you guys actually walk into a big open room, do actually look up and be a bit careful. Now, there's going to be a couple of items I did want to showcase here and show the fastest location to both of them before showing the boss fight. The first one here is going to be a Great Ghost Glove War. I might have said that wrong. Probably did. Now besides the item and most likely exploring the catacombs a bit, here's the fastest way to the Death Knight boss fight. Keep in mind guys, this is actually going to be insanely far away from the side of grace, so I would say a lot of players are most likely going to have a challenge to get there. But defeating the Death Knight is going to get you the Death Knight's Twin Axes and the Crimson Amber Medallion plus 3.
Now there is one last thing I did want to throw into the video for the Fog Rift Catacombs. It does turn out toward the end of this area there is going to be another special area you can get to. Crazily enough guys, every time I go through one of these catacombs or basically anything in Elden Ring, I always stumble upon something new. So for this though, I would say this is going to be easily missable. But going up into this area though, you can get yourself the Stone Sheath Sword and a few other items.